What's cracking but cracking? I'm JC Swain. And I'm Atlee Stanley, back with your announcements. Just a reminder for those who park in the house floor parking lot, the marching band asks you to please have your vehicle moved by 245. They need all the space they can get in the parking lot and want to avoid any cars being damaged by equipment or instruments. Congratulations to the winners of the SGA Leadership Team election. Applications for new members are now open and posted on QR codes around the building, due by September 8th. The nominees are in. You can vote for this year's homecoming court through the link sent to your student email. Be sure to vote your class grade only. The homecoming football game is September 15th and the dance itself is on the 16th. The ceremony to announce members of the court will also be held at the September 15th football game. Tickets will be sold the week of the dance during your lunch period. If you want to bring a guest from another school, forms will be available in the front office. Also, attendance will be tied to whether or not you are eligible to attend the dance, so if you have too many unexcused absences, tardies, or detentions, you may not be able to attend. Youth lead applications are out, and students eligible to apply have received the QR code and information to apply. The applications are due September 22nd. Please email Wendy Watts if you have any questions. Sign-ups for the first blood drive of the year are here for students with first hours in houses 4 and 5, the Ag Hallway, Band Room, and Gym. Biomed students will be around with forms for those interested in signing up and will be picking up on Friday morning. If you are late to school, please use one of your five parent excuses. This can be done by having your parent or guardian call the school or email Melissa Clark. Students who are late to school without an excuse will have to serve an hour of after-school detention the following week. You can keep track of your attendance on Infinite Campus. Drivers, parking spaces are marked and available. They will soon call students down to clean spots, starting with seniors. Reminder, if you need to study for an upcoming driver's test, please do not print out the manual. The school has provided printed copies in the library for students to borrow. MCHS will be taking 40 juniors and seniors only to learn more about careers in the river industry. The field trip is Wednesday, September 13th from 7.30 a.m. until 2 p.m. Permission forms may be picked up in Dr. Lisa Stevenson's office, House 1, second floor. Forms must be returned by this Thursday, September 7th. On September 12th, Jocelyn will be here to talk to juniors during first period and seniors during second in the auditorium. Colleges are starting to visit for seniors interested in attending. The University of Kentucky will be here on September 29th during first period in the cafeteria. And Murray State will be here on October 11th, and the University of Louisville is coming on October 22nd. Paducah Tillman is hosting a college fair on September 19th in their gym from 5 to 7 p.m. The event is open to everyone. Remember, for students who ride the bus, please be respectful to those around you and follow the bus policies to maintain a safe and comfortable environment. Students who fail to abide by these policies will not be allowed to continue riding the bus. For those who didn't get their picture made on the 30th, Makeup Picture Day will be on October 24th. And for seniors, Honors Picture Day is October 25th. A list of seniors who need to attend will be out in late September. Also, seniors who just need a yearbook photo can get one on the same day for $20. Volleyball will be playing against St. Mary tonight at home. Also tonight, women's golf will be playing against Ballard and Mayfield. On Thursday, September 7th, men's soccer will be playing Mayfield away and women's golf will have a match against Massac County. Varsity football will be playing against Mayfield away on Friday, September 8th, and volleyball will be playing in Effingham. On September 9th, women's soccer will be playing for the Mustang Cup at home, and women's and men's golf will be playing at the Bowling Green Invitational. For lunch on Wednesday, we'll have wingdings, pepperoni pizza, grilled cheese, lasagna roll-up, and your usual options of salad bar and grab-and-go boxes. For our sides, we'll have mashed potatoes, lima beans, and red grapes. For breakfast on Wednesday, we'll be having confetti pancakes. Arriving at school Wednesday, the weather will be 75 degrees with thunderstorms. And leaving school, it will be 86 degrees and partly cloudy.